What is patterned balding? Simply to say there is a particular pattern in which your hair is going. Very commonly male pattern and female pattern. A female pattern you start seeing by a widening hairline or a partition line. So you see it widening. You see more balding around the central but the top area of your hair. That's more female balding. But while there is a male pattern balding, you could have receding hairline which almost looks like an M on you. And there is more right on top but behind the head here. So that's where you start losing. It is simply to understand different patterns. That's it. So the significance could be just a little bit of hormonal change, familial pattern to understand. Another pattern though which is not a patterned baldness is alopecia areata where it is autoimmune but you see a clear chunk. There is no female or a male pattern but a clear chunk of hair which is just gone. That could be another pattern that you end up seeing on the hair. Variants of this you could see in receding hair line itself, receding even from the neck upwards, sometimes receding from the sides. All this could be different pattern of an alopecia areata. You could also see something like a frontal fibrosing alopecia wherein you will see in the front the hairs you start to lose hair but there's also skin changes there. You start to see the skin become more thin scar like tissue. So that's another pattern. So depending on how it looks on the head, doctor can pretty much diagnose what kind of hair fall you have. Therefore, do some relevant tests and then prescribe the right kind of medicine. This is also to tell you that not everything can be solved with just doing a few therapies of PRP and mesotherapy. Diagnosing what is your cause of hair fall becomes very, very important.